A scathing new report by the Army describes a culture of sexual harassment and assault at Fort Hood in Texas. Fourteen base leaders, including two generals, have been removed or suspended. CBS's Maria Virial reports tonight from Fort Hood. We are not going to fix some of the challenges we have here at Fort Hood unless you get on board. In front of thousands of soldiers, Fort Hood's commanding officer, Lieutenant General Robert White, took full responsibility for the failures outlined in the report, including a finding that only 59 out of 93 accounts of sexual assault were actually reported. What do you say to the victims who did not have enough confidence in the Army to report crimes like sexual harassment and sexual assault. Well, for those victims that are out there that will not report, the first thing I did was I gave everybody my phone number. You can call me 24-7 if you don't have confidence in your chain of command. In the 136-page report, an independent panel issued nine findings, including that the command climate at Fort Hood has been permissive of sexual harassment and sexual assault. Today's revelations gave some soldiers the courage to speak out and finally be heard. So for the first two weeks, three weeks I was back, I was living in the same barracks with the person who raped me. The nearly four-month investigation comes in a year in which 31 soldiers assigned to Fort Hood died by suicide, accident or homicide, including the murder of 20-year-old specialist Vanessa Guillen. Before her death, Guillen told her family and friends she'd been sexually harassed on post, something the Army continues to investigate. It's for us to keep on um, asking for justice to find those who are responsible. In the report, one soldier said she felt like sexual harassment and assault was like initiation here at Fort, Fort Hood. It's a sentiment shared by two victims that we spoke with just minutes ago. The Army Secretary says these 70 reform recommendations are just the first steps to solving this big problem. Nora? Maria Real, thank you.